Spurge here with Revzilla, and in this video, we're gonna break down the built velocity air pants available at Revzilla.com. Built is one of the brands that's exclusive to us here at Revzilla. And the one thing that I wanna note about this is I've been very excited to see what Built has been doing with their Lux line. Their Lux line of off-road gear is their top of the line premium lineup. And a lot of my friends have started using the Lux pants because of the mass amount of stretch and the affordable price point. The Built Lux pants come in around the $80 price point and you can usually get a season of hard off-road use with them. So a really great step up that we've seen them incorporate with the Lux line. Now the Velocity Air Pants are not part of the Lux line, but we're really seeing a lot of what they've developed with that particular pant carry over into this, but this is a much more breathable mesh version. Now, I got a few nitpicks here, but we're gonna walk through the entire video. I'm gonna break this down for you, and I'm gonna talk about what I would like to have seen differently, what I like, and really where I think Built should be going with this particular line of gear as they continue to you know, really enforce their desire to be a top line player in the world of dirt apparel. Now this is an in the boot dirt bike pant. So Built is really saying that this is gonna be for you off-road riders out there, not necessarily MX, but more trail riding. Frankly, most of my friends are using the Built Lux pants as a trail pant. So I think it really can be interchangeable depending on the features that you're looking for. So start with sizing, and then we'll get into all of this that I really do wanna break down. So sizes will range from a 28 up to a 44 in the waist. The one note here is Mr. McHugh is my model. He stands at six feet, weighs in at 220 pounds. He's typically wearing a size 34 in his pants across the board. He's currently wearing a size 36, and they're none too large on him. So what I would say is if you are looking at these pants, size up one full size from what you would typically wear to get a comfortable fit out of them. Now, keep in mind that Pat is wearing knee braces over these as well, so you wanna make sure that, like I said, you're making that one size up, not just to fit around the waist, but to make sure that you're fitting around the knee braces. Pat is currently wearing a set of Liat C-Frame Pros, which are pretty much one of the bulkier braces on the market, and they fit over those completely fine. Let's break down what you're gonna see. You have two different colorways available, and I think this is one of the limiting factors with Built right now, is that for dirt riders, we love our flashy colors. If you've read any of my articles or seen some of my videos where I'm wearing polka dot jerseys or bright fluorescent yellows, typically people like big bright colors. If not, they go buy a, a climb setup. Well, Built is really kind of aiming for more of their muted tones. These are gonna be available in black or black white. I think it would do them justice to come out with some crazy wild colors and graphics, but really that's not what we're seeing from them at the moment. Looking at these particular pants, what you're gonna see carry over from the Built Lux line is the 600D main chassis area. Now you have these laser cut perforated holes. That's gonna help with airflow. On the Built Lux, you had those as well, but these new Velocity Airs have three times the amount of perforated holes cut into the 600D. They're then adding all of these big 3D mesh panels to the front of the leg for a tremendous amount of airflow. From a closure standpoint, you are gonna have the plastic ratcheting buckle and a bit of elastication on the side. I would have loved to have seen some 3D mesh over here on the side. Pat, go ahead and strike the, uh, the right hand pose for me. So you're gonna see that 600D material carries through to the side. I would have loved to have seen some of this four-way stretch mesh down the side, just to give you some extra flexibility with this. That mesh paneling is gonna come around to the back of the leg and then down the side, you're gonna see that 3D or that uh, laser welded perforation cut into the 600D goes all the way to the back as well. So for those of you out there looking for a very breathable summer pant, the Built Lux was probably you know, not breathable enough for you. This is gonna be your mesh option within the Built line at this point. Now the one thing to note, look at the inside of the legs here. So you have that four-way stretch that comes up behind the knee you then have that poly that comes down. There is some reinforcement on the poly on the inside, but you lose the leather gripper panels. This is a big miss. So really these pants are coming in at the $70 price point, right? That's $10 less than the Built Lux. I would have easily paid the extra $10 or even more to have those leather gripper panels on the inside. And you know, if you're wearing knee braces, even with the leather, leather gripper panels, uh, you know, a lot of us out there will wear through a set of the leathers within a riding season or two because you're really digging in with your knees. By not having that on the inside, you're just not gonna have that extra grip that leather provides for the plastics on a dirt bike, and you're not gonna have any of that extra beefy protection to keep the pants from wearing through where your knee braces are. So I would love to see leather added here as it sits right now. 
I would say this pant is gonna be more for you casual trail riders out there. If you're really looking to ride competitively and dig in with your knees, you're probably gonna wanna bump up to the built Lux. You're gonna sacrifice that airflow, but you're gonna get those leather gripper panels on the inside. Pat, go ahead and face backwards for me. Built logo at the top of this, really tall yoke. I like this at the back of the chassis because if you are in more of that tucked over position, this gives you full coverage and you are gonna have that bead of, uh, of silicone on the inside. So if you are tucking in your jersey, it stays into place. Big four-way stretch at the back of the seat on this. And then you are gonna have that reinforced polyester at the seat. And then there's a clear line down the back of the pants. Sir, go ahead and face forward for me. So hits and misses. Like I said, I really liked what Built, Lux, Built, was Built was doing with their Lux line. Amazing amount of stretch they carried over with this particular pant. The one thing that I think the Built Lux line missed out on were pockets. Now, I know that Built was saying that that was an MX pant and that you really wouldn't want pockets on that, but most of my friends are using that pant in a trail riding enduro situation where having a cliff bar or your wallet or something in your pockets is a viable possibility. I just like having pockets on my off-road pants. I would love to see a side slash pocket or something on these as well. So that's something that I'd like to see Built do in the next iteration of both the Built Lux as well as the Velocity Air. And really the, the main thing here is I love the mesh chassis. Really, I just wanna see that extra leather included in this pant. I think these could be a really great option for trail riders out there that are riding more competitively that want airflow. And I, I'd be willing to go ahead and pay the extra 10 or 15 bucks to get this up into Built Lux territory because really that's what these are. These are the Built Lux pants with mesh panels added to them. So I like what Built is doing. I wanna see a few more iterations as this rolls through, but as it stands right now, for those of you out there looking for just a great trail pant that's gonna breathe a ton of air in the warmer months of the year, this is an option for you that really doesn't break the bank around that $70 price point. Now there's a lot of folks out there that are utilizing Built, my friends included. If you want more information uh, from riders that are currently using this setup, you wanna hear what they have to say, click the info button on your desktop or mobile device, read other rider reviews from folks that are putting the Built Lux line or the Built Velocity Air rather through their lineup. Read them both, read the reviews on both and compare to see which pair of pants is right for you. If you're still confused, you're not sure where to go, you can always give one of our gear geeks a shout, 877-792-9455, or shoot an email over to cs at revzilla.com and talk to one of our gear geeks that can walk you through all the different options available for dirt bike pants to make sure you find the right setup for your ride as well as your budget. I wanna thank you for joining us for this look at the Built Velocity Air Pants. I'm Spurge, enjoy the ride.